All right, tonight we're wrapping up another beautiful day in Pittsburgh. How about this stunning sunset shot from Homewood a couple hours ago? Let's check in now with Ray to see if if the sun has set on the best of this week's weather, what do you think? Uh, we still get plenty of sunshine, so so that's going to keep rolling. Temperatures will go up a little bit, but uh, cool temperatures. I mean, we haven't had that too many times, especially a streak like this throughout the summer. Let's look at just the past 31 days. The oldest time is way on the left side of your screen over there. And what we're seeing is most times we just get a little cool day here, a little cool day there, but we ended up with a batch of them. Uh, Saturday, Sunday and yesterday. Today was one degree below average, so this has been a nice little cool wave that we've been having and temperatures tonight are going to fall again from where we stand right now down generally into the low to mid 50s. In most cases, it'll be a little warmer here in the city, more like the upper 50s for a bit, but I think it's going to be a very comfortable night and low humidity and I think the low humidity continues tomorrow, although we'll jump those temperatures up a little bit. Plenty of sunshine there, plenty of sunshine on Thursday, although Thursday Thursday, while we increase the temperatures a little more, we're also going to increase the humidity. So this is going to be the biggest uh, change in how it feels outside. But the biggest change in the weather comes when we get into Friday and we see the clouds come back and then some scattered showers and thunderstorms start to take over especially as the afternoon progresses. So a better shot for rain and thunderstorms uh, later on Friday, and that's going to carry into the weekend. Something we don't need to worry about tonight. Just crack the windows open, let the fresh air in. Temperatures upper 50s for lows tonight. High temperatures tomorrow make it into the low to mid 80s. This is a more typical temperature for this time of year. So average temperatures making a comeback to the area. It's going to start to feel like mid August again and those temperatures stay in the mid 80s for Thursday as well. Friday, this is a day where we start to turn on the thunderstorm chances. So uh, early on, I think it's going to be dry, but by the time we're getting to the afternoon, you can see those rain chances return. We'll get some showers. Even a few thunderstorms can't be ruled out. and You'll definitely feel that humidity in the air. Air, especially if you get a peak or two of sunshine. Then we get into Saturday, more rain and thunderstorms. Those are going to continue on and off through the day. Then you'll notice the biggest batch of the moisture starts to shift to the north and to the east. And what we're going to end up with is maybe a spotty natured shower left over once we get into Saturday. Sunday, still a few, or I'm sorry, Monday is still a few thunderstorms left over. And then Tuesday, I think that's when we start to dry it up with temperatures in the upper 70s.